Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, we're going to put some drive in your tennis. Some Yonics drive. Stay tuned. All right, coffee sponsor of today is at Trevor Wright. Oh, it's my buddy Trevor. Thank you. Thank you for the coffee, Trevor. Uh, Trevor writes, hit the Pokemon store and the manga stores. One piece. I guess you're talking about stringing. <laughs> I hit the Pokemon store when I was over in... Uh, in Japan and it was actually really cool it was very interactive obviously they want you to play those games and buy the stuffed animals there's a lot of stuffed animals and they're super cute my daughter wanted a bunch of them and obviously I couldn't get it home so we didn't get anything for her except for Hello Kitty <laughs> But thank you, Trevor, for the coffee. We had a great time in Japan. Um, thank you so, so much. If you want to be my coffee sponsor of the day, network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. You want to hook up the channel? Super thanks is the way. Link is below. You can hook us up with as much or as little as you'd like. All right. Cheers to you guys. Thank you so, so much for your support. All right, Pete's was still brewing Gaia over here. You know, kind of kind of sucks to be back. <laughs> I really enjoy Japan and I only get to enjoy it. I mean, it's been 3 years, so uh I'm only there for 10 days. So we're testing out the Yonex Polytor Drive today. It's a 16 light 125. It looks like an ALU in this kind of a silverish gray. Feel it in here. Round string polyester monofilament. And they call this an average string. My guess is that means average stiffness. Because why would you call something an average string? Look. Firm plus, firm average. Soft, soft plus. So I'm guessing it's kind of in the middle of soft and firm. So they call it average. I guess we'll see if this is an average string. Maybe medium firmness would be a better word, but that's okay. It actually kind of stretches here. Let's get on the machine and string my blackout with it. All right, so just finishing up stringing my own racket with it. Poly Tor Drive. It kind of has a ALU kind of a feel. It's not as firm though. I could definitely feel that. It's a little softer. When I pull it back, there's actually some kind of movement in here. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you that again. So, th so there is some type of a take back there, which means that it does stretch. I'm gonna put my finger right here and then and then let it go. See, I could feel that there is some give there to this string which means it's gonna be a little softer. It's got the texture though of an ALU. Um, I'll do power to some of you, but it's got the softness of like a black coat, like a technofiber black coat. Um, interested to see how this is actually gonna feel. My guess is it's gonna hold tension decent but probably taper off after a few hours. Um, I'll bet the initial hit will be pretty soft and last for about a good hour of, of stiffness is how I feel it when I'm stringing it right now. But I'll let me finish it up and 
see how it feels on the court. All right guys, so we just got off the court with the Yonex Poly Tour Drive, the average poly string that Yonex makes. Um, unfortunately, before Coach Chris could try it in the video with his racket, he broke it. Therefore, in the hitting footage, we all used my racket. And we didn't have time during the video to string Jared's racket with it, so we all used my average racket for this average string on this average video since you broke your string first you average tennis player talk to me about this average string <laughs> all right this average string it actually plays a lot like alley power <laughs> uh, it's definitely got a, lo a lot of uh, power to it but after hitting it a couple times, you definitely get more feel and bite to it um, as, it, as it comes down to it. But um, played with it on Harry's racket, and after getting used to the obscene amount of weight he has on it, um, you can definitely see that it complements the racket very well. It definitely is very pow powerful, and I think it's a good alternative to kind of your you know confidential alley power strings. Yeah, definitely would recommend it. All right. Coach? Jared, what do you think of this average polyester? Yeah, so let's uh, hopefully I can give you guys an average review from an average tennis player on this average string. <laughs> um, but yeah, I have to echo a lot of uh, Coach Chris's comments. I think this is a uh, pretty similar string to Luxon and Lou Power in the terms of I think Yonix is trying to make something to compete with it. So I think it had a good grip, good bite, and uh, at the same time, I don't know if that was a string or Harry's heavy racket here because it has a ton of lead tape on it. But regardless, I think the uh, strings in the racket complemented each other pretty well. Um, again, I think I could feel the uh, the flex from the from the string bed and also felt the uh, string snapping back into place pretty well. Um, but yeah, tons of power, tons of feel, and overall a pretty good overall average string. All right. So I actually like this average string. When, when I rate this thing, it's very, really average. It's got a good um, batting average for tennis. And uh, I guess since I'm a below average person, I might like an average string. Okay, enough about the averages. This actually plays very well. It actually plays very familiar. It plays just kind of like my string. It's a little on the firmer side. Surprisingly holds tension pretty well. It snaps back, it's got good feel, there's good predictability in it. Um, I mean, there's not anything that bad to say about it. Price point is right. It's about half the price of the, the high-end stuff. Um, average price. Yeah, average, average price. price yeah, very, very average, average price. Average. So I would definitely recommend it. We all seem to like this average string, right? So let's sum up this average review. Coach Jared, where can we find you? <laughs> you guys can find me at my average Instagram at Ma Tennis. All right. Where can they find your average tennis player person, Chris? <laughs> you can find me at CB Chen Tennis, and that's average. <laughs> guys, thank you for watching this average review of this average string, where we put your average tennis on your spin.
Oh! I, I got you, Rob, buddy. Look, I got you, Rob. Oh, man. Yeah. I got you, Rob. I got you, Rob. Thank you for thank you for the weekly lesson, dude. Oh, I got you, Rob. I got you, Rob. I got you, Rob. Now, if you want a patient pro just like Coach Rob, hey, play your court is the place. The, your pro can come to you, right? They can come out to your site. All you need to do is go to playercourt.com. You can even get a discount there. Playercourt.com forward slash tennis fit. Harry, are you sure you're right-handed? <laughs>